Hey friends, Tux here. For this particular video, we're going to be talking about Guardians of the Galaxy. There's been a lot of information lately about Guardians of the Galaxy 2 coming out. And I have to admit, when the first one came out, I was real psyched about it. I seen it and it was good, but it actually was just, I thought it was great. Like maybe like a B or so or a C plus. And then actually after seeing it again later, I think I enjoyed it as much or more. So I'm actually really excited about the next Guardians of the Galaxy. The one thing which bugged me about the movie, and you guys, the fanboys are probably going to be mad at me, okay? But I really wish the sound track was a little more updated. And I know the point was it was like on a cassette tape and it was like 70s music or whatever, but I wish they'd take that leap up just like 10 more years and go to the 80s or something. Um, I think there's a lot of great 80s music that would be a little more upbeat and a little more fun than like some of the 70s music they used in this movie. 70s music is just a little ahead of my generation and my time period so of music that I enjoy. So it just seemed a little off to me hearing like some of the 70s music. And some of it worked, but it was a little bit much, you know. But um, I'm really excited about the next one and I got these blind bags and stuff at Hot Topic. So let's go ahead and open this up and find out the deal. What do we have on the inside? And I'm sure it's going to be the same characters. You know, of course, our one's favorite is Rock Raccoon and, um, and uh, Groot. It's like, how could you forget Groot's name, okay? Um, so anyway, these are really cool. And I do have, I guess before I open these up, I'll show this here too. I'm not going to unbox this. I think I'll keep this actually in the box. But this is something which was clearance as well. And this is a, a vinyl collectible from uh, this company here, uh, DRBZ. Dorbs or something. I don't, I don't really collect these, um, but they do have some really cool characters, and it was super cheap, so I figured, what the heck. And I do like Rocket Raccoon, and there is some really cool, if you like high-end stuff, Hot Toys make some amazing, amazing Gardens of the Galaxy stuff. And on uh, Visigoth's channel, she actually has the Groot and Rocket Raccoon, the Hot Toys one, which is like a two, three hundred dollar toy. It's really cool. It's a back away in her queue, but if you're into Gardens of the Galaxy, you may actually want to check out that video because it is just an amazing, amazing sculpt. But um, anyway, this is pretty cute for five bucks. I gotta tell you, I'm digging that little rocket raccoon. -y. He's all smiling. His eyes are kind of scrunched up. So very cool. We'll keep this in box for the collection. But let's go ahead and open these up. Now in here, of course, the characters I like to get would be the main cast. And that would, of course, be I, I really got to get a Groot. I got to get a Rocket Raccoon. Got to get Tall Groot. Uh, Star Lord's cool. And the other ones are all great. It looks like there's several of, of all the more popular characters. Um, I don't really care too much about the Nova Corpse person, but if we get it cool and, and the Drax guy is okay, but I really care more about the main characters. So, anyway, let's see what we have in here. Let me see if I can do this without a knife. Oh, yeah, there we go. We got this. And I think the Guardians of the Galaxy 2, I want to say it's coming out. Is it next summer? I'm, I'm not sure. Um, it's coming soon. Yay, I got a Groot. That is awesome. Look how cute this is. Oh, it does come with a little stand, so that's cool. We'll pop that out. And I do like the way these little stands do kind of lock into each other. See the little edge there, so that's really cool. And I don't think Groot actually has... Does he have a, a peg? Oh, it's actually a bobblehead Groot. Wow, that is so cool. How weird is that? Is there anything else in here? Let's see. I feel like I'm missing a piece. No, no. Okay, I guess I guess he doesn't really need the the little stand because this just fits onto the thing. But check out, it's actually kind of a, a bobbly head Groot. So that's really cool. And the one thing about Guardians of the Galaxy 2 that surprised me is I guess Groot is still in this like baby form. So um, that's kind of interesting. We'll see if he grows up into a full-size Groot somewhere during the movie. But at least in the preview I've seen so far, the clips, it's like he's baby Groot still or like young, small Groot. So anyway, very cool. One down. Let's see if we can get a Rocket Raccoon next. Let's see what we have. I really thought the Star-Lord character was really well played. Like, I thought he was uh, very entertaining. So I hope they have him. Um, I'm sure it's the same actor and everything. But I hope they continue the good writing that made that movie so good. All right, next up is... Oh, wow, we are having great luck, guys. Check it out. It's actually Adult Groot. And this one here should have a stand, I think. Yeah, it does. The stand is right back there. So we'll pop this in place here. Very cool, like that. And here is full-size Groot. And I guess all these must be bobbleheads because this is a little bobbly too. It's not a full tail bobblehead, but pretty cool. He has a little hole here in the back. We'll just stick this in the hole. And we will have Groot standing for all of our entertainment. Yeah, that's looking good, man. I'm digging that. And these will fit right in with the other ones I have. I have Deadpool. I have some of these Deadpool ones. So that's cool. So two down. All right, next up, Star-Lord. Let me see if I can guess every one of these. And the next one is, it's Star-Lord. Oh my God, I should play the lottery or something. I swear, I, there's no codes. I don't know anything. This is just dumb luck. All right, Star-Lord, let's see what we have here. 
Okay, we'll put the stand together here. There we go. And pull out Star-Lord. And this character is pretty cool. I like his attitude in the movie. Um, well played, good, good effects, a lot of fun. Just, I wish they had better music. Get better taste, Star-Lord, okay? Please. Anything with 70s music. I love the way he's dual wielding two lasers, which is really cool. And, of course, a little bobbly head and kind of a funky mask thing going on there. So, very cool. Um, wow. You know what, guys, would make my day? If this is a Rocket Raccoon. I think there's one Rocket Raccoon? Yeah, uh, two. There's two. If this is a Rocket Raccoon of either the red one here, that's the rare, red is a rare chaser figure, or the orange Rocket Raccoon, that would be awesome. I, my luck is never this good. Three for three, guys. I am shocked. All right, come on, Rocket Raccoon. No doubles. If I get doubles, um, you know I use doubles for giveaways, so it's okay. But let's see what we have here. Come on, Rocket Raccoon. And it is... Oh, it's a Groot. Uh, wah, wah, wah. But at least it's a cool devil. So this is something somebody might want or something. So we'll go ahead and throw this into my little... Uh, we'll put this back in here and uh, use it for a prize down the road or something. Or a trade. So anyway, guys, pretty cool. We did pretty good. Three out of four ain't bad. Is that how it goes? I say two out of three ain't bad. So three out of four is pretty awesome, actually. We got both Groots and we got Star-Lord. So pretty cool start to the collection. I'll keep working on these if I see them on clearance. And I'm sure there'll be more toys coming out as the new movie comes out. But I want to thank you guys for watching this video. Uh, this is one for the record books, guys. I cannot believe I got the three things I wanted most, like, right in a row. So that is really cool. Um, be sure and subscribe if you're not a subscriber. We do have a new giveaway coming up, the 5,000 subscriber giveaway. There'll be more details about that coming up down the road. And also, I'm um, going to be doing a Q&A coming up uh, for 5,000 subs, a little bit after 5,000 subs, but pretty close. I promise I'm going to do it. And um, so if you put a question in this video, um, that's cool. Or if you want to email me the question, people have done that already, um, just send it to tuxtoys at gmail.com, okay? Um, or I'll have a special video maybe requesting questions. And if I get enough questions, I'll go ahead and do a video for it. So anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching this video. Be sure and check out Tux Reviews, my review channel. Got lots of cool videos going up there. I have Kevlar Gaming and help me out with some free hardware that I'm reviewing, uh, clothing stuff, tech, fashion, everything. It's all on Tux Reviews. And also be sure to check out my beta channel called Gamer Tux, all right? All right, friends, we'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.